so today we are discussing on a very important topic which is relevant to the overall health of a woman the reproductive health of a woman and since we are discussing about world contraception day series there is lot of dialogues and conversations we are planning with our experts because the topic of contraception is often neglected and considered as a taboo in many houses even today because of which the reproductive health of a woman suffers so while i'll take the guest in who is dr nitika sopti and many people already know about her she's a renowned name in the field of female health so i as i take the guest in dr nitika sopti who is an obstetrician and gynecologist at cloud 9 hospital gurgaon i wanted to understand from each one of you what exactly you are doing for your own reproductive health we as women often neglect this thing we don't discuss this and shun it away thinking it as a taboo but i wanted to understand from all the women who are joining us what are you doing for your own health because a happy mother will raise a happy child so as i take the guest in i wanted to understand from each one of you and thank you so much for taking out time for this important topic while i guess uh, dr nitika is about to join us uh, she is also the founder of virtue baby and through her youtube channel she has already helped lots of women and now also helping so many women who are planning for a baby so i think dr nitika is already here dr sopti i have already sent you a request so meanwhile as dr nitika is joining us and people joining us please share what you are doing for your overall reproductive health Let me just, Doctor Sopti, I have already sent you the request. Those joining us, please let us know. Am I audible to you? Uh, Renu, we are discussing more about its gynecology sessions. So we are not talking about skin problem. We'll surely bring some session on skin as well. So the topic today is more about your overall. reproductive health i think uh, there is some technical glitch that dr sopti is on to out to join us let me just take her in again thanks aarti for letting me know so people joining us while our guest dr nitika sopti who is a founder of virtue baby she is also obstetrician and gynecologist at cloud 9 hospital hi dr sopti welcome hello how are you dear am i audible All right. yeah you are audible uh, okay okay sure Sure. So, Dr. Nitika, as we were talking about, like I was discussing also while you were joining yeah. in about the reproductive health of women. So today we yes. have so many options that are available, but how safe yeah. are these options? Because often we don't know about it or we are not aware about these options. Yeah, uh, sure, my dear. I know when every month has a very important theme, and anything which helps us bring keep ourselves healthy and bring healthy children into the world, I think that is something which we really need to keep discussing. See, contraceptive options are all safe. Everything I always tell will have two side effects. One will it will have some failure rate. The other will it will have some side effect. So any contraceptive options, nothing is foolproof, but they are very very good methods. In fact, I have been talking about it in the last one or two years, very firmly that any contraceptive method, if it will have a very low failure rate. the side effect profile will be little more to thoda sa side effects mm-hmm. honge uske but if supposing the failure rate is very very high the side effects will be very very low meaning simple barrier method condom mm-hmm. there are there is no side effect it's pretty safe but it has a failure rate to the tune of 10% which is not less you know uh, there was one uh, there was one national population survey no last one was done in 2021 so they found out very important facts about contraception when they did the survey see we are just not talking about urban women we are talking about mm-hmm. all over india true because this is a problem that everybody is facing and why i call it as a problem because actually this is a problem which is a correctable problem this should not be a problem this should just be a fact and discussion so they said that 99% of young women and men in the reproductive age group unko pata hai they know all the options unko sabko idea hai unko sab pata hai but 
the usage is being done by 40-45%, but because of our government initiatives and, you know, all of us also are very focused now, even in the urban cities, we have increased it from 44-45% to about 55%. And that's not a less number, as if we call about the increase. But if we look at still only half of them are using it. The rest 50% are still not using any contraceptive method. So we really need to know what are the methods which are available. There are some traditional methods, you know, um, Latika, because traditional methods mean one is barrier method, condoms, but I told you the failure rate is about 7 to 10%, which is very high. Another method which we talk about is the withdrawal method, the natural method. That is also not very safe. They have, that has a failure rate of 15%. So I always say, supposing you have one child and you don't want a second child very soon, but still you want to plan. So mm. still for those spacing, you can use these. But once you just cannot go with these traditional methods, which is calculating the safe period, which is natural method of withdrawal, which is barrier method, because all these three, unka failure rate is from 7 to 8% to 20%. So we just cannot afford to use these three once our family is complete. The and even now the women are facing the PCOS issues. So now there, there is no certainty about that. Uh, the cycle also, whether that is a safe cycle also or not. Yeah, but you know, we have a lot of awareness on PCOS. This mm. is also the PCOS month. Mm. Somewhere where we see is, koi bhi problem ko Hmm. We've been talking about True. PCOS four years and now everybody is dealing with PCOS. Every patient who comes to me, at least out of 10, five to six will have PCOS. Even at my home, my daughter, my cousin's daughters, everybody has PCOS because we're just talking too much about it, Latika. Hmm. It's just a lifestyle disease. That's the only thing. And it's not that it was not before. But her diets were very, very sorted because the availability of food was when the mother is going to cook. True. Now availability of food is on the click of a mouse and not just that, it's available 24 by 7. So you eat late, you have more, more hormone levels, your leptin levels will rise, they will soar. Your insulin sensitivity will again be very high. You will have PCOS. So if you have to revert it, we just have to go down the a, a good healthy living style. It will happen. So when we are talking of PCOS also, our spacing needs to be very clear. Our hmm. contraception options need to be very clear. Our reproductive health needs to be very clear, whether we are planning or we are not. Oh. So that is something which we need to really understand because lots of myths circulate. About hormonal pills, about mm -hmm. multi property, you know, IUDs, just go on layman language, maybe call it as a property, but now we have mm -hmm. better multi load, Freedom 5, which are they are, why, why are they better? They are only better because they are causing less of side effects. So we have other options which are conclusive options. First and foremost being hormonal pills. They are very good. There is no problem using it. But they should be used under supervision of a doctor. A, a lady, she is already having, you know, depression or she is having migraine. Mm -hmm. And if I prescribe, if they take pills, that is not going to be helpful. That will cause a problem. Or somebody has a history mm -hmm. of certain problems in the family. You know, thrombosis ho sakta hai. Bohut sare hai. Cancers ho sakta hai. So we will be very, very selective. That's the only challenge. But because of these little four or five things, we can't shun a method as not safe. That's what happened. So, if you take a pill, everybody will think, oh my God, pills are not to be taken for long. So, I tell don't take it for long, but take it for at least one or two years. See if it works for you. True. So, I think... Uh, like as you have mentioned also under the supervision of an yes. expert only that is required because yes. many times 
we have seen on the platform also the queries that comes that people are not planning for a second child and then things happen and then they they ask that whether it is safe to take which pill so we always recommend uh, that we are not a health uh, platform so we cannot recommend it so the members also come in but then this awareness is not there even if we are telling Absolutely. them we don't yes. know whether they are taking it or not so how yes, yes. to uh, how to deal with this and especially when it comes to second pregnancy that like i was discussing also with you that there are women who don't want to plan uh, or the partners doesn't want to plan but there are a lot of pressures from the family and then they're not taking uh, care they're not taking contraceptive uh, like options mm -hmm. and then they go towards abortion and then ultimately yeah. leads to the health of the women so or Absolutely. sometimes with the child also because mm. when the child is born there's a lot of baggage of negative emotions throughout that pregnancy the women gave because the women was not ready for the second pregnancy. child so how yes. to make yes. them aware about this particular thing that they have see, now the part to conceive see very importantly you know latika we have to be very very clear about one thing which is very important that using a method is very important for them for their reproductive health as i said kyunki if their reproductive health is fine then only they can have that power to conceive and reproductive health and mental health because they are both interlinked now if we are not using a method and you have and the, you, there is a conception there are two options one is that we will not go further with it because we are just not ready okay so if you are not ready we are using an abortion method that is mentally and physically distorting for the mother's mind and body mm -hmm. both because any intervention is not help is not at all right so very importantly what method of a spacing there are three options which are available you know the study which i was talking about the national population survey which was done in 2021 mm -hmm. a very important fact came out that everybody is aware about the contraceptive options but the usage by men is only 9.5% so that is the level of use it so we cannot rely on barrier method we cannot rely that means we cannot rely on condoms we cannot rely on the natural method we cannot rely on the safe period method so that's one, one thing clear so what are the rest of the methods that we have one is a hormonal pill but when you know when the when the, when the baby is born you can't use those routine pills because you the you are feeding the baby so that is a little thing out the second option is multi load or coperty which i say so everybody gets very you know hassle coperty lagane se bleeding bahut hogi infection ka risk hoga wo apni jagah se displace ho jati hai so i just give them a very simple option latika i said so many of us are using contact lenses whenever we start putting a contact lens what happens there is little irritation there is little watering of eye and slowly slowly in 3 4 months the lens will find its way and then you keep using it for years and years give mm. give your uterus a chance it's a foreign body and you know the size is just this much it's hardly 3.5 cm so when we put it the body is going to reject it because it's a something new the body doesn't want anything new but we are wanting it to be set inside because if that suits you you are going to have a very easy 3 or 5 year period with nobody to look on then it's your thing because it may cause a little discomfort to you initially ho sakta hai thoda thoda issues aaye but mm -hmm. that issue is less than you carrying the load of a pregnancy when you're not ready for it and dusra mai kehti hu dalne bhi humne nikalna bhi humne nikal denge it's just a small procedure you don't need anesthesia it's an opd procedure but the acceptance is not very good why you know because everybody who doesn't jinko suit nahi karti hai who are not comfortable with it everybody comes out in the open and says it was really wrong mm -hmm. it, but whoever are using it nobody talks that i'm using it and i'm fine because we, i think we don't the negative have those things forums. even when we talk about Absolutely. the negative things come more easily when we talk about the positive things so people yes. just talk, even with c section deliveries also yes. there are lot of yes. misconceptions in the mind of people yeah so that is what and now, that maybe and now we are some people also now who are becoming self proclaimed uh, health experts and that is also a problem that is coming up uh, which is that is why some wrong misconceptions are also going out in public 
It's because, you know, having a good family life and being very open because, you know, Latika, this is a very closed forum and we are all mm-hmm. here to share and discuss. You know, you need to be very, very clear that every mother, would-be mother, expecting mother, a new mother, you know, all of all of us need to be very, very secured because otherwise we can't have a balanced married life also, our mm-hmm. sexual life also, because if it's all the time on the mind, it is very distracting for both the partners also. So it's very important that some method needs to be used. And in those some methods, as I told you, you have very good methods available. You reach out to your gynecologist. Even I am very open to explaining it to you. There is one more very important, uh, you know, pill, which is a non-hormonal pill. And abhi maine uska, abhi video bhi, I think abhi maine ka tha, 26th ko hi dalna. It is okay. known by the name of Saheli. In government hospital, okay. it is it is by the name of Saheli. And otherwise, it is its name is Chaya. It is available in the chemist. It has no, no side. It's non-hormonal. One. It has no, no side effects of weight gain, mood swings. Even if you have any, you know, any thrombosis or any migraine or headache or depression, it does not cause any problem because it is non-hormonal. It increases the bone density. It does not affect the breastfeeding. So it is a very good pill. Now the only challenge is that it has to be taken very regularly. For first three months, it has to be taken twice a week. When you bought detail, I have made video of it. twice a week lenge and start karna day one. Pe. Matlab, day two pe nahi start kar sakte. Bas, itna hi hai uska. Three months ke liye twice a week le, uske baad once a week. So that's also one very good method. So for people who want good spacing after they start having regular menses, because you know, yehi wala time hota hai, Latika, jo sabse zada vulnerable time hota hai. True. Immediately that you have delivered, you're a new mother, you're struggling with your responsibility of taking care of the child. You want to have everything as normal as set, but there's so many things going on. Your mind is also not very powerful at that time because you're so involved with the child. So contraception is the last thing you want to be talking about. But it is also very important because I have so many mothers coming to me within six to nine months after con- Conceiving. In fact, just last week, you know, I have I had one patient. She was an IVF conception. Every two three months, I will have one IVF conception coming within six months with a natural conception. Hmm. Because mind easy hai. Mind ne to ye soch liya ki hona hi nahi hai. Matlab mind ne to ye soch liya ki mujhe to pehle jab IVF kar raha hai to ye mind ko pakka tha ki nahi ho ra, nahi ho ra. So the body was reacting. Abhi mind silent ho gaya. Ho ra hai, nahi ho. Ra. Subconscious mind ko koi input nahi ja Abhi she's so happy with the baby. She's so comfortable, easy. And they're not even using contraception because it to hua hi nahi paan saal. Ab kaise ho jayega? Hmm. And that happens. So what I'm trying to say is this time is a very, very important vulnerable time. So we should have the awareness and understanding of what all methods are available. So pills is not a very good option, the hormonal pills for first one year, but non-hormonal pill, once you start having periods, you can start taking, it's very good. Because in In fact, this method comment is really promoting because this medicine has been made by the CDRI, by Central Drug Research Institute of India in Lucknow. And this is a very old drug. I don't know why all of us are not talking about it because I talk about it a lot. It was first manufactured in 1970s. It's that old the medicine. And it is available in the government hospital also. But now they've started promoting it. Because the government is making it, there's pharma company. And it's so, it's so low cost. You know, Latika, eight tablets for 25 rupees. Can you believe it? Can you ever have any medicine? Because this is a government initiative. So, you know, they approached me last year. And then I Mm -hmm. talked on their channel about it. They spread the word in many, many villages and two tire and three tire cities. So this Chaya medicine is also one non-hormonal pill. So in pills, we have two hormonal pill 
which has to be taken cyclically 21 days on 7 days off and not when you are breastfeeding and only up to the age of 35 years but with this non hormonal pill sirf period aana chahiye ek aa jaye bas first day pe start kar liya uske baad ka koi problem nahi hai i think query also yeah. related to ovulation yeah. sure, how, sure. Uh, i yeah. don't know the name because it just went away no uh, that the, no. so it was about that uh, how to know about the ovulation if you don't have a ovulation kit if i have talked about the say right because yeah. there was something about ovulation yeah say ovulation ka jo time hota hai na we if we take a normal cycle which can be something between 28 days to 35 days okay so now our ovulation period we extend from 11 days to 21 days so during this time see checking your temperature every morning when you get up your mucus the the cervical mucus also thins out it becomes watery these are the two normal signs of ovulation little bit cramping pain you know some patients are so sensitive they have that middle schmerz pain of ovulation but you know i i always tell my all my mothers all my you know expecting parents don't go too much into symptoms if you have not been able to conceive in 6 months to 1 year and if you are less than 30 to 1 year tak to just take it easy but if you are in a hurry then hum ye natural methods of checking ovulation pe karenge na they to are very very confusing all the time you will keep thinking so take a kit and do it because kit is also not very certain so if kit is not very certain natural methods are even less certain mm -hmm. the the most certain thing is the ultrasound because when i when i when i talk about you know the rates i think every mother every would be parent should know that that if you're less than 30 the chances that you will conceive in, in you know every month that is 25% as i told you now 25% and 40 pe wahi cheez 5% ho jayegi agar 30 se 40 ke beech mein ja rahe hain to it is going to waver between 20 to 15 so our goal is that more than 85% of you will conceive in one year's time if you are less than 30 and between 30 35 wo thoda thoda drop karta hai wo zyada nahi karta wo 85 to 75 hota hai but agar hum 40 pe jayenge to wo 40 mein 44% 40% ho jata hai and today we are finding quite a few females you know in the age group of 35 to 40 40 so ovulation ke agar hume checking karni hai if you are you know less than 30 you can have an idea you will get you you will get it around you know 14th day 16th day all these three things your body temperature will be a little high 99 fir aap roz check karo fir uske liye 11th day pe karo fir 12th day pe karo fir 14th you know that also is okay if you are comfortable you can do it but once you are in that age group where you are nearing 35 don't strain yourself too much just go with the flow four months just be easy and do it we have a wide range day 11 to 21 maine apne youtube channel pe maine har cheez dali hui hai how to check for ovulation how to use the kit what are the natural ways to conceive faster and healthily and in our hearts you know latika all of us are very well aware today True. and one myth should be clear that using a contraceptive method will never ever decrease your chances of conceiving that, true that is for sure i think as you mentioned about your youtube channel also like during my pregnancy days i used to follow a lot on your youtube channel i yeah. think that is where i encountered you and there and i stumbled and then i came <laughs> and, but then so that is how the nice. kind of information that you you are giving also and every time because it's not only one time or something so many issues that you talk about it sometimes it's so relevant we wanted to talk to someone and your youtube channel has that solution it's like <laughs> you're talking to someone who is understanding our problem also yeah. so uh, as you have mentioned about ivf so these is ivf egg freezing is also yeah. very uh, promising uh, yeah. so how safe are these options also uh, for a woman who's planning to conceive see now we talk about egg freezing latika bahut clearly hame usko demarcate de karna hai why you know why are we uh, use why are we uh, doing this freezing of eggs uska reason kya hai it can be personal reason it can be your age factor it can be that you have some tumor or something some medicines are taken like today i had a female she had two pregnancies which were molar pregnancies molar pregnancy mein 
क्या होता है बेबी नहीं बनता जो प्लेसेंटा है वही बनता जाता है और उसमें हमें कीमोथेरेपी भी देनी पड़ती है क्योंकि वो इन्वेजिव हो गया सो अब शी इज राइट नाउ थर्टी फोर आई डोंट वॉन्ट हर टू कंसीव फॉर टू ईयर्स एंड आई हैव टू स्टार्ट अ कीमोथेरेपी सो शी इज अ कैंडिडेट जिसको मैं कहूंगी यू गेट इट डन बिकॉज लेटर ऑन इवन इफ We don't get the eggs because if I give a chemotherapy, वो एग्स तो उसके और खराब हो जाएंगे सो एटलीस्ट मैंने उनको निकाल के रख लिया है सो वंस शी इज टोटली हील इवन एट थर्टी सेवन थर्टी एट इफ आई वॉन्ट आई हैव हर एग्स विद मी वी विल डू इट या किसी की शादी नहीं हुई है लाइक आई एम इन क्लाउड नाइन हॉस्पिटल गुड़गांव सो मेनी थर्टी सेवन थर्टी एट ईयर ओल्ड दे आर नॉट मैरिड इट दे आर सो बिजी इन देयर कैरियर so for them i i will give them as an option now the art bill is so so clear otherwise people were doing egg freezing and donating eggs and earning because pure lifetime mein ek lady ke andar you know you have any idea how many eggs you have in the entire lifetime 300 to 400 eggs will be released every cycle 4 to 5 eggs try to get released but only one releases and at birth wo 1 to 2 million hote hain and by the reproductive age they go on to a few hundreds only see so how much fast the germ cells are dying so they very very labile so if we want to do egg freezing first we have to see what is the egg count usme wo ek blood test hota hai everybody knows about it also which is called as amh which is an anti mullerian hormone तो वो हम पहले ब्लड टेस्ट लेते हैं उसको देखते हैं देन वी गिव अर सम मेडिसिन जिससे वो ओवरी स्टिमुलेट होके एक की जगह ज्यादा एग्स निकाले फिर फिर हम वो नीडल से जाके अंडर एनेस्थीजिया स्टिमुलेट करने के बाद इमिजिएटली वी सी ऑन दी अल्ट्रासाउंड हाउ मेनी एग्स आर देर एंड देन वी एस्पिरेट देम देन वी वो वॉटर उसके बीच में से निकाल के उसको फ्रीज करते हैं बट एक चीज हमें समझनी है कि जब हम फ्रोजन एक्स की बात भी करते हैं तो चांसेस ऑफ लाइफ कंसेप्शन आर बिटवीन टू टू ट्वेल्व परसेंट फ्रेश एग की ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट होगी तो फ्रोजन एग की अराउंड ट्वेल्व परसेंट होगी बट इफ यू हैव अ एग फ्रॉम अ यंग एज लेडी वो एंड दे कैन यू कैन फ्रीज इट फॉर यू नो अभी तक वो स्टडीज ही नहीं है कि कब तक टेन ईयर्स ट्वेंटी ईयर्स आगे तक भी यू कैन फ्रीज तो अगर एक यंग लेडी का हम पंद्रह साल बाद भी एग यूज कर रहे हैं फ्रोजन दैट इज बेटर देन टेकिंग एन अ फ्रोजन एग विच इज अ सिक्स मंथ ओल्ड फ्रॉम अ ओल्डर वुमेन सो एज ऑफ द वुमेन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो वी शुड इफ वी आर लुकिंग एट एन ऑप्शन ऑफ फ्रीजिंग वी शुड डू इट एट द राइट टाइम वी शुड डू इट विद द राइट डॉक्टर ऑफकोर्स द इंडिकेशन वाई वी आर डूइंग इट शुड बी वेरी क्लियर ट्रू बिकॉज कई लोग अभी अभी आ रहे हैं कि हम फ्रोजन इम्रियो भी कर सकते हैं If you know that the partner is with you only, so that is also one good option because उससे at least हमारा union हो जाता है हमारे egg की quality maintain हो जाती है हमारे embryo को फिर हम check करके genetically भी transplant कर सकते हैं maybe even after one year, two years, three years, four years. So technology is very advanced. Ah, uh, as you have mentioned, a lot of things that even I don't know personally, but that lack yeah. of awareness is there. Yeah. Because people are not talking about it only. Absolutely, they are not. Think- Uh, that talking. such kind of dialogue or con- conversation should come in picture, especially yeah. because it, it, it now everybody is so literate, yeah. and they should have that awareness. Yes. And people are busy with their careers as well. And moreover, diseases also like you're talking about PCOS. There's another disease which is endometriosis, Latika. Endometriosis में क्या होता है कि जो uterus की lining होती है ना, वो lining. Supposing now this is the uterus and this is being lined by a lining, so that lining will come out. So menses हो जाएंगे. बट अगर वही लाइनिंग कहीं कहीं और है ओवरी में है ट्यूब्स में है तो वहां पे सिस्ट बनते हैं और सब कुछ आपस में ना चिपक जाता है सो so, एक्स की क्वालिटी बहुत ड्रॉप कर जाती है लाइक आई डिड अ सर्जरी जस्ट थ्री थ्री फोर मंथ्स बैक ऑन अ गर्ल आई डिड दैट सर्जरी फॉर द सेकंड टाइम एंड शी हैड बिग यू नो ओवरी के अंदर सिस्ट टू द ट्यून ऑफ एटीन सेंटीमीटर नी इज राइट नाउ जस्ट अबाउट ट्वेंटी I actually told them. I said I really want that you should freeze her eggs, because if it happens again, then we have to do surgery. Mm-hmm. Na, 
but mm-hmm. you know that awareness is so lacking people can't understand and i don't blame them because we don't talk about it wo priyanka chopra ne finally bol diya to phir bhi koi baat kar raha hai abhi ek reason ki but it is true it's important like on an average every month i have one or two people whom i feel should get their eggs frozen but and the taboo is there कॉमन नाउ so that that these are things that we really need to Latika even if you have one child still just get your fertility potential tested ones so that आज आपको नहीं चाहिए योर चाइल्ड इज जस्ट वन और टू ईयर्स थ्री ईयर्स द चाइल्ड विल गो टू स्कूल उसके बाद वो फर्स्ट सेकेंड में आ जाएगा यू बिकम फ्री एंड द चाइल्ड इज इन द स्कूल द चाइल्ड इज डिमांडिंग वन सम कंपनी एंड देन यू आर ऑल्सो वेरी वेल सेट इन योर करियर everything is perfect you want to conceive again now your one child is 7 years 8 years and you want to now you have a desire and there's so much going on am i too old should i do are there going to be so many complications if i conceive so mere kehne ka matlab hai ki ek pregnancy ho gayi to apna fertility potential check to kara lo beshak mat karo so you know ye trail nahi aayegi thoughts ki and it goes dusra hum baithe hain hame pata hai Um, so, Abhi today only I have delivered one lady. She is forty-three year old because I just when I called you, I was extremely busy because she was an IVF conception, forty-three year of age. रात से वो आई हुई थी. So, बहुत सारी सीरियस चीजें चल रही थी. So, just I did a cesarean and took out the baby at thirty-one weeks only. The baby hmm. was very small. So, when we talk about elderly age, when we talk about IVF, we will definitely talk. about higher complications and challenges True. so aise mein na ek freezing se na hum kafi bach jayenge in sab problems se sir settle hum sab kar lete hain abhi bhi wo baby theek matlab nursery mein rahega ha because 31 is okay to ho gayi to but mera matlab hai ki supposing 75 and married for 9 years okay so you know you understand what i'm trying to say that if we have this option in place on the top shelf of the mind to wo knowledge use okay convert hogi for their own mm. benefit <laughs> true because sometimes like all of us think that the career is important even now mm. but i think egg freezing as you have mentioned since there is no information or people are not talking about it people are thinking acha this is just a taboo we don't have to think acha this is not going to happen with me this happens with someone else but this is not going to happen with me we are so healthy mm. so these kind of things are also there in the mindset of people yeah yeah absolutely talk about it the more uh, information that if even if they are planning late uh, there is an option of egg freezing that they can do yes i think there is a query also someone who asked that uh, i think vidya some uh, name that uh, yes. she is planning to conceive a uh, 30 plus what is that diet uh, for first baby planning the first time and what is okay. the healthy to conceive 30 plus that's right the pre conception diet if we talk about kuch bhi alag se main nahi sabko bolti hu i always say that we all know what are the nutrition parameters we all know what are the vitamin parameters our diet should be rich in you know all antioxidants rich in zinc in magnesium in selenium these are all things which are so much available in all the seeds they are available in all the greens they are available in all the other vegetables as well so main sabko kehti hu ek cheez karo make sure when you are eating eat it at the right time that is very, very important we are very bad at timing of our foods you know mm-hmm. i mean all of us at least jab plan mm-hmm. kar rahe hain ya pregnant hai na tab to zarur dhyan rakh le in fact you know latika i just in this nutrition week also i have posted a pre conception diet ka video also okay. so i think vidya vidya is seeing that can go back yeah yeah you can just search even in our insta so i last year so i did one one full reel for all the things for reducing pain During menses for heavy bleeding, everything has a diet. But in a nutshell, if we talk, 
जो हमारे कहते थे कि फ्रूट्स हमारे बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट होने चाहिए सारे कलर्स डाइट में उसी से आते हैं हमारे सैलड्स बहुत अच्छे होने चाहिए हमारा खाना नॉर्मल घर का जो हम खाते हैं ना विच इज लेस ऑफ रिफाइंड फ्लोर दैट इज वेरी गुड एंड नाउ डेज आई वॉज इवन थिंकिंग दैट हमारा ग्लाइसिमिक इंडेक्स लो करने के लिए क्योंकि पीसीओडी इज सो मच हाइप एंड सो मच प्रेजेंट ऑल्सो बिकॉज ऑफ आर बैड ईटिंग हैबिट्स ईटिंग मिलिट्स विल बी अ रियल रियल चेंज because what we have done wrongly we will be able to make it correct rectify all that so with your having millet diet at night will reduce your glycemic index having more of seeds will increase your antioxidant level because all the germ cells they are actively dividing so you need to have, have things which don't take too much time in your intestine so that will really mm. give your body good health because the energy conservation will start and there is a lot of thing about milk you know lactose intolerant hai hmm. pcod and milk ka linkage bhi bahut hai so either we get it tested because i i am not a dietitian so i i will not be able to actually be open about it because mujhe personally lagta hai that we should be very clear that agar humne band bhi karne hai na to let us go to a person and get it evaluated hum hmm. hoi na lactose intolerant aur hum band kar le ya aisa kar sakte hai agar hume pcos ke liye karna hai So, उसके हिसाब से बिकॉज पीसीओएस बेटर होगा तो कंसेप्शन बेटर होगी और माइल्ड लेवल ऑफ पीसीओएस तो अबाउट टेन में से फाइव सिक्स को है ही है और फाइव टू टेन परसेंट भी वेट कम हो जाता है ना हमारा तो उससे भी हमारा एग की क्वालिटी इंप्रूव होती है एंड इवन इन द मेल्स इवन इन द मेल्स आई एम टेलिंग यू इफ द बी एम आई इज हाई द टेस्टोस्टेर लेवल्स आर लेस सो दैट not very healthy there is a lot of infertility and subfertility with high bmi in the men of course everybody knows smoking and alcohol is absolutely not good because the most actively dividing cells are sperms they are the most fragile of all the cells present so ab ab socho toxin to unko tang kare gaye so apni diet aapki healthy hogi to definitely aapke partner ki bhi healthy ho jayegi हफ्ता दस दिन अगर वो नहीं भी हेल्दी करेंगे आपको देख देख के वो भी हेल्दी कर लेंगे सो मिलेट्स इज ऑल्सो वेरी गुड ऑप्शन क्योंकि उसका ग्लाइसेमिक इंडेक्स बहुत कम है और बहुत बहुत फास्ट उस वेट लॉस भी विद इन टू मंथ्स काफी दिखाई देता है सिग्निफिकेंटली फायदा भी हुआ बिकॉज ये मैंने पर्सनली भी एक्सपीरियंस किया है और मैंने पेशेंट्स के साथ भी मैंने बहुत एक्सपीरियंस किया है एंड मिल्क प्रोडक्ट में भी ना मुझे लग रहा है हम कट डाउन तो कर ही सकते हैं बिकॉज जो दूसरे जो, जो भी मिल्क भी अवेलेबल है प्रिटी ओके कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं है उसमें सो so, अगर पीसीओएस का एलिमेंट है तो ये सब भी करिए अदरवाइज हैव अ जनरल गुड डाइट एंड हमने अपने वर्चु uh, बेबी के वेबसाइट uh, पे भी और हमारा वर्चु बेबी के स्टोर पे भी ना प्रीकंसेप्शन डाइट प्लान है मैंने ऑलरेडी क्रिएट करे हुए हैं मैंने पीसीओएस के भी करे लतिका मैंने प्रीकंसेप्शन डाइट प्लान्स भी करे जिसमें डाइटिशियन की कंसल्ट भी है सो दैट दे कैन टेक यू थ्रू प्रेगनेंसी के तो है ही है बट दीज आर अनदर वन और टू थिंग्स विच आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड अदरवाइज नहीं भी लाइफ प्लान लेते तो बेसिक प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ डाइट आप फॉलो करेंगे तो इट्स ऑल गोइंग टू बी गुड I think Vidya, who's watching us, can go back and, as Doctor Nitya uh, explained also, on what you baby YouTube channel, you'll find out, and on her Instagram handle also. There is uh, before we end this session, this is a very insightful session because personally also we came to know about lo- lot of things that were not we, like we know the terms, but we don't know about the importance. But before we end, the last query that we wanted to take is someone sure. who mentioned uh, that she's 35 years of age and she's planning a second baby, but she's not getting. Uh, The regular periods are not able to conceive. So how? Like I think she can consult you personally on that. Yeah, yeah, no problem. The only thing is that we should always have a preconceptional workout. Workout. Very important. We should be seeing what is the number of eggs. Secondly, we should be seeing what is your weight. Thirdly, we should be seeing. कि वाज़ द फर्स्ट कंसेप्शन नॉर्मल और नॉट वाज़ इट अ चैलेंजिंग वन सो दिस वन और टू थिंग्स एंड हाउ मेनी मंथ्स हैव यू बीन ट्राइंग बिकॉज़ आफ्टर 35 फोर फाइव मंथ्स तक इफ यू डोंट कंसीव इट इज गुड टू जस्ट कम एज आई सेड चेक योर फर्टिलिटी पोटेंशियल एंड दूसरा ये ये बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है हमारा माइंड जो है बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है क्योंकि कंसेप्शन सिर्फ यूट्रस ओवरी ट्यूब्स से नहीं होती है यूट्रस तो करता ही है माइंड से होती है यू कैन सी फर्स्ट इन द माइंड सो आर सबकॉन्शियस माइंड इज गेटिंग ट्रेन फॉर समथिंग विच एवरीबडी शुड बी वेरी वॉचफुल अबाउट 
बिकॉज हम आसपास जो देख रहे हैं ना इट इज गेटिंग इन टू आर सिस्टम सो मैं सबको बोलती हूँ प्री कंसेप्शन डाइट प्लान लेना है तो ले लो बट उससे पहले जो डाइट खा रहे हो उसमें इंटेंशन डाल दो दैट एन एंजल इज कमिंग टू मी माय एंजल आई एम वेटिंग फॉर माय एंजल गॉड इज सेंडिंग एन एंजल टू मी सो दैट आई कैन टेक केयर ऑफ दैट बेबी सो दैट इंटेंशन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो दैट एवरी सेल ऑफ योर बॉडी रेडिएट्स दैट इंटेंशन एंड ऑटोमेटिकली द बेबी विल कम पहले क्यों नहीं होते थे इतने आई सेंटर्स पहले भी होती थी थोड़ी इनफर्टिलिटी बट इतनी नहीं थी लतिका नहीं थी पहले रीजन बींग बिकॉज अभी हम लोग इतने सारे चैलेंजेस के थ्रू जाते हैं ना सो मैं सबसे इंपॉर्टेंट चीज बोलूंगी अपने सबकॉन्शियस माइंड को नेचुरलिटी के लिए ट्रेन करो आपको पता है हमारे पास ना कितने माइंड है एक तो हमारा कॉन्शियस माइंड होता है एक हमारा सब कॉन्शियस माइंड होता है एक हमारा हायर कॉन्शियसनेस माइंड होता है और फिर एक सुपरा कॉन्शियस माइंड होता है तो जब हम डी मेडिटेशन स्टेज में जाते हैं ना जो बहुत यू नो बहुत स्पिरिचुअल पर्सनालिटीज होती हैं या बहुत जो वो वो सुपरा कॉन्शियस लेवल तक जाने की कोशिश करती है हायर कॉन्शियस माइंड पे काम करती है फॉर सम टाइम क्योंकि उनके ब्रेन वेव्स वो हमें बताते हैं और जो सब कॉन्शियस माइंड है ना वो हम सब अपना एक्टिवेट कर सकते हैं एंड लतिका ये पर्सनली भी ट्राई करके देखना अपने लिए भी करना अपने बच्चे के लिए भी करना बिकॉज हम लोग ना बहुत सारी वरीज क्रिएट करते हैं कई बारी और वो वरीज हमारे सेल सुनते रहते हैं सारा दिन तो हमारे कॉन्शियस माइंड के साथ साथ वो सब कॉन्शियस माइंड में भी वो वरी चली जाती है जैसे कोई कहेगा मुझे तो पॉलिसिस्टिक हो रही है मुझे तो कंसीव होगा ही नहीं आराम से कोई कहेगा मुझे तो होना ही नहीं है मुझे तो पता है बहुत डिफिकल्ट है आजकल तो किसी का भी नहीं होता दूसरा मतलब यू नो दिस इज लाइक थिंग सो आर सबकॉन्शियस माइंड इज गेटिंग ट्रेन टू डू इट सो हमें राइट इंटेंशन डाल के देनी है अपने सबकॉन्शियस माइंड को सुबह उठते ही दस मिनट फर्स्ट टेन मिनट्स और लास्ट टेन मिनट्स बिफोर यू स्लीप बिकॉज ये दो ही ट्वेंटी मिनट्स है पूरे चौबीस घंटे में जब ये सबकॉन्शियस माइंड जागा हुआ है तो ये फीड करो यूनिवर्स आल्सो वी आर सेंडिंग यस तो जो जो कराना है वो अपने सबकॉन्शियस माइंड में बोल के विजुअलाइज कर लो उसको तो अच्छा हो जाएगा दैट रियली वर्क्स दैट रियली हेल्प यू Thank you so much for today's insightful session, and and it's always a pleasure having you. There's a lot of personal grooming also. Every one of us gets uh, and understand also okay. things. And uh, this last query again, there is one more query. Someone is asking that uh, is the ovulation day is a twenty four hour uh, window only? No, like she's I'll planning to conceive. See, I'll just tell you. This one, one minute, we will 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 tell you. you know and the sperm is alive for 5 days 1 to 5 days so we have a lot of long period so main sabko pata hai kya bolti hu ek principle hota hai jaise hamari cycle 28 se 35 40 days tak hoti hai to hamara ovulation period day 11 to 21 so main sabko kehti hu do, do cheeze use kar lo friday saturday tuesday ye aise wala kar lo ya friday संडे वेनेसडे ये तीन दिन जरूर इंटरपोज करना यू नो थ्री डे वीक वाला बिकॉज वीकेंड वी आर फ्री सो वो वाला पीरियड जो हमारा होता है ना थर्टीन से लेके एटीन तक का उसमें ये तीन दिन में से कोई ना कोई तो आएगा ही आएगा सो so ये वाला पीरियड आप जरूर टैकल करना क्योंकि अगर आपका ओविलेशन हुआ और आपने उसके दो दिन बाद भी किया उसमें भी प्रॉब्लम नहीं है क्योंकि ओविलेशन आपको पता कैसे लगेगा अभी हुआ है अगर आप किट से चेक करें तो किट से जब चेक करेंगे उसके 36 सिक्स आवर्स बाद ओविलेशन होती है सो so, जिस दिन आपने पॉजिटिव देखा आपके पास उससे अगले पांच चार दिन है और स्पर्म तो है ही है फाइव डेज के लिए सो विच इज फाइन सो वो स्पर्म सर्कुलेट कर रहे होते हैं पहले भी और बाद में भी तो अगर हम ये तीन ले लेते हैं ना वीकेंड के दो या एक और मिडिल ऑफ द वीक वेडनेसडे सो हमारा काफी कवर हो जाता है दिस इज अ स्टडी व्हिच हैज बीन डन टू गाइड कपल्स फॉर हैविंग अ बेटर बट बेटर फर्टिलिटी सो यू कैन आई थिंक वी नीड मोर एंड मोर सेशंस विद यू टू गेट द आंसर टू बिकॉज़ लॉट ऑफ वीमेन आर फेसिंग दिस इशू मतलब ऑन द प्लेटफार्म आल्सो डेली वी हैव क्वेरीज रिलेटेड टू दिस And I'm sure in the coming days we'll be having more insightful sessions with you because the kind of information you are now giving to us is also very new and <laughs> relevant. Also, I have done this too. I have made positive affirmations. 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 I have made positive affir
I want every parent on this earth to visualize what they are creating before the child comes. So I have made pre-pregnancy meditations. वो भी उस virtue baby store पे available है. And ये जो मैंने आपको subconscious mind की बात बताई है, मैंने उनको बोला है कि ऐसे ही सुनो और visualize करो. उसमें पूरी है blessing the womb, rest and sleep, checking your ovulation. वेलकमिंग योर बेबी इवन इंटरकोर्स से पहले सेक्रेड यूनियन पे क्या सुनना है मतलब आई हैव मेड इट इन दैट फॉर्मेट सिमिलरली फॉर आई वी एफ ऑल्सो आई हैव क्रिएटेड कि जब आपको करना है एक जब आपके एक जैसे आप एक पिकअप कर रहे हो तब क्या करना है जब आप फ्रोजन डाल रहे हो अंदर फ्रोजन ट्रांसफर कर रहे हो फ्रोजन एम्ब्रोय ट्रांसफर कर रहे हो तब क्या सुनना है तो टू वीक्स के लिए क्या सुनना है सो आई डिजाइन इट इन सच अ वे दैट योर पॉजिटिव एफर्मेशन आर ऑलवेज देर विद यू इवन पोस्टमार्टम फेज आज हमने उसके बारे में जैसे बात ही नहीं करी बहुत चैलेंजिंग होता है पोस्टमार्टम फेज हर मदर को होता है मैं बता रही हूँ वो होता है वो कभी कभी हम निगलेक्ट कर देते हैं बट वो होता है ज्यादातर निगलेक्ट करते हैं ज्यादातर मुझे कोई हार्डली हैप्पी मदर दिखती है बिकॉज उनकी गलती नहीं है बट वेर डू वी टॉक अबाउट इट सबको होता है ये कह देते हैं तो मैंने उसके लिए भी ऐसे of affirmations create kari hui hai 40 meditations jo us time sunni hai why because hamare hame khud ko heal karna hai etika as mothers we need to be very sure that we have to be very strong and we should be very knowledgeable to hum hai aur hum usko grasp bhi kar lete hain sirf us hame baat karni hai iske bare mein zyada so i am sure sab sahi rahega <laughs> thank you so much for today and i'm sure in the coming days again we are going to disturb you and bring you more for the insightful session So thank you so sure. much for today, and I'm sure the audience has got a lot of information. And if anybody wants to connect, they can connect on Virtue Baby Insta handle personally with you, because today sure. it was actually a very enriching session. We planned uh, for part to conceive, we talked yeah. uh, about the contra contraception thing, but apart from that, there are a lot of personal things that women are facing that also came during the conversation. So thank you so much for today. Sure, my dear. Thank you so much. Take care. Thank you. So much. Okay. Yeah. Bye. So this was Dr. Nitika Sokti who joined us today uh, from Cloud9 Hospital, Gurgaon. Uh, she is also the founder of Virtue Baby. And in the coming days, uh, as we have seen so many queries during the conversation was coming up, and a lot of personal issues, uh, especially with the reproductive health of women that the uh, people on the platform are facing. So in the coming days, we are planning for with more expert sessions with other doctors. So thank you so much today for joining and. Coming out and speaking about because it's very important when the woman voices out the issues, then only we'll be able to bring out the solutions. So I think through today's conversation, we got to know about this that how contraception was a taboo, but then how it if we look out look into it, it is actually talking about the overall reproductive health of a woman. So thank you so much all of you for joining us today, and we'll be back again with another important and information and informative sessions. Thank you so much.